Hello guys, John here, and today I'm giving a review on G3. Uh, I I I did some research on it, and after the arrival of the September batch, uh, the profit the profitability has decreased ton of time. So let's see how it's gonna help you, and how we can like compare Bitmain and Inosilicon, and which one is better and which one is is worth the money you know so let's go into the detail uh if we go to crypto compare.com and check out the profitability of the dash mining so if i just it's 15 gigahertz 1200 watt and uh in, in the area where i live it's like 0 0.01 per kilowatt so the profitability is right now 1513 dollars but it's going to decrease a ton of time when the November batch reaches. And I'll tell you why. Why it's going to go down and down. Because there were tons of other ASIC miners which has higher speed. And they will be they, they will be arriving in, in late November. So let's see. Let's, let's go into the details. Mm. Now let's go to Dash Mining Calculator over here. And see how much is the difficulty if you can see the difficulty level is on this it was like one one million in the beginning when the September batch of Bitman and minor G3 was not launched so if you can see it has increased like almost three to four times and if we go to if we go to Google and type dash mining yeah dash difficulty is difficulty graph and it's by kind wars so if we type in that and we we just look for the difficulty graph and if we just compare uh this week because it's been a week that they have launched this uh that the september batch has arrived so if you can see it's like if we just go to maybe one day you can see it's hitting like maybe 5 million and it's coming down to 3 again and now it's it's almost on on 4 so so with the passage of time because eno silicon if we go to eno silicon not this one we go to maybe there is we go to eno silicon yeah and if we just compare the speed of the of the two in the price and i'll tell you why let's go to bitman as well so then you guys can see if we go here straight to bitman which takes you straight to the to the all products if you can see let's go to the top you see because this is the second batch of Eno Silicon and its price is 9999 USD which is very very expensive now if I have to buy it I will never buy this Eno Silicon A5 dash master if it's like maybe if it's on $4000 I will give it a go but it, on 9999 it's a bit more expensive and if we go to Bitman and check out here, where is D3? You see, it's fourteen hundred and fifty fifty dollars, right? And they will be releasing the December batch very soon. So, and if we compare the price, you know, if we like, let's see. Let me find my calculator, like. If we go to 9,999 divided by 1,450, we get like 6.89. Like, and then we multiply by like we like one A5 dash master hardware is equivalent to 6.89 uh, Bitman D3. So if we multiply by 15, that's the speed of the uh the the d3 so 
we are okay we got something unusual let me go again so 9999 divided by 1450 so it's like and then we multiply it by 15 so 103 gigahertz and this this f5 dish master is giving us 30.2 gigahertz so why why would i buy something that is like 103 and if like there was like if i would still have bought it but if the the speed like if the speed is like 50 gigahertz and the delivery time is like in october uh, or in the early october i would have bought it but not yet not now because it's not worth it the difficulty level is going to increase a lot you know when the other October batch of D3 arrives and then November batch arrives, so difficulty is going to increase. So um, did this 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 is too much for this speed, you know. So I would suggest that why won't I buy like six D3s instead of um, instead of uh, one A5? If you have power issues, then this could be a bit, but it's not. Like uh, power is not that much, you know, won't cost you that much. So you should check out why would I buy something that is like like 10k, you know, and something that is 1450 dollars. Why won't I buy like six of them? And if look, look at my power cost, it's very very low, 8.64 per month, you know. And if I multiply by like six, you know, let's go to calculator again. And if I multiply by 8.64, multiply by uh, 6, or maybe same one, let's do same one, 60.48. And if I go to maybe 750 watt, and if I go to, uh, if I go and type in maybe 38, let's go to the maximum. It's giving me, but in November, uh, Keep in mind in November, uh, the figure is not going to be this. It's going to be really, really low. It's going to be almost maybe $1,000 or maybe $1,500 or even less, or $700. You cannot predict the difficulty. But if you can see the graph uh, for one week, uh, you can see the spikes were here. It's not like here. It was not going above that, you know, $4 million. Now it's not like... It hit six million as well, and it's gonna increase day by day, you know. So it's all up to you, but that's my review for D3, and I hope you like it and mm, you share it with with others, you know. So that's it, guys. Hope you will like the review. Thanks. Have a blessed day. Take care.